Mr. Speaker, honorable colleagues, I come under a rule, rule 8, uh, under A rule 4, and under the leaves of the our, uh, our, our house rules, to ask that you grant me permission to move a motion on the urgent need to investigate the status of our medical and pharmaceutical research in the fight against COVID-19 and other diseases in Nigeria. Mr. Speaker, you are aware that the pandemic is affecting 200 million Nigerians and this is of public importance and urgent. I so move. The status of medical and pharmaceutical research in the fight against COVID-19 and other diseases in Nigeria. The House notes the coronavirus pandemic and its related consequences on our people and various economies across the globe. The House further notes that out of about 4 million over 4 million confirmed coronavirus cases the world over. Nigeria has witnessed over 6,000 confirmed cases with about 191 deaths as of today. The House also notes that 472 laboratory cases of Lassa fever, including 70 deaths, were confirmed in 25 states of the Federation and their city between January 1 and February 9, 2020. The House records how the outbreak of Ebola disease brought into Nigeria by Patrick Sawyer from Liberia resulted in 19 confirmed cases of infection and eight deaths in what is widely acclaimed as having been effectively contained. The House is worried that the cholera, that cholera remains a disease of public health importance in Nigeria associated with high mobility and mortality. The House is aware of the various efforts by the World Health Organization and the world economies to curtail the effects of these diseases. And the recent declaration by Madagascar that he had found the cure for COVID-19. The House is further aware of the disclosure by the Governor Central Bank of Nigeria reported in this day, May 11, 2020, that the bank is developing a framework for provide support to aid the fight against coronavirus disease in Nigeria. The House is further aware of the need for a methodical approach by the federal government in providing effective coordination supervision mandates and funding for intense medical research for cures of the diseases and for local production of essential medical supplies used in the fight against the disease in the country. The House is aware that the drugs for today's societies are products of intense medical research by individual scientists and major pharmaceutical companies. The House is alarmed by the revelation by the Director General, National Agency for Food and Drug Administration and Control, published in Vanguard May 14, 2020, that the agency has received only one application for approval of a product for the treatment of symptoms of COVID-19 and no cure, no cure of the disease, a situation that would be different but for lack of coordinated government effort and funding for medical research. The House is concerned that while countries are overwhelmed and occupied with their challenges, Nigeria appears to depend entirely on external interventions in the health sector for our economy. The House is conscious that Nigeria is endowed with qualified and talented scientists who are capable of developing indigenous skills for the disease. The House is mindful of the need for a homegrown approach in dealing with the threat and spread of these diseases. The House is also cognizant of the need for government action 
in assembling and mandating medical researchers towards developing indigenous solutions for health care needs. The House results. One, to mandate the House Committee on Health Care Services to investigate the extent of government coordination, supervision, mandate and funding for medical research in the fight against coronavirus pandemic and other diseases in Nigeria. The House finally resolves to make that mandate the committee to make appropriate remedial and sustainable recommendations for the health sector and report back to the House within three weeks. I so move.